Hi, welcome to the Ask Patrick series. Here we are trying to give you information regarding different management entrance uh, exams, the concepts and anything that will help you. If you like the channel, you can subscribe to the channel. You can also, if you like the video, please do share it and like it. Okay. As far as today's question is concerned, so we take questions on a regular basis that will help you too in terms of preparation what students do ask us. Today's question is by Shreya Das. Question is, how many common questions do I have to practice every day okay, in order to crack the cat? Now, can't, you cannot put a number to it. So let me say minimum maybe 10 questions. Let me put a number, say minimum 10 questions. The maximum could be anything. I mean, if you're really fast in solving con, maybe you can even do 40, 50 questions, but not required. If you're really good in con, technically you should spend less time on con and more time on your other sections. So yes, minimum I would say 10 questions, but don't focus on numbers itself. A lot of people, what they do is they focus on solving too many num con questions without trying to learn from it. Look, understand the way the questions that come in the cat. It's more of logical base. You need to understand the question and then solve. The moment you try to focus on only solving too many questions, what happens is you don't try to analyze alternate methods. You try to solve the question as fast as possible and move to next question. In that case, what you do is just put a formula, get the answer and go to the next question. Your learning doesn't happen that way. You will not improve. What you need to do for every question that come in con, once you solve it, try to look out for alternate ways. Try to see is there a better way of solving a good way of solving. So you may take more time per question. Okay. But that more time per question will also help you give you a learning experience that could help you in a longer period. Also, don't spend too much of time. I right? say 10 minutes per question is sufficient. Some time for going to a question, some time for trying to solve, some time for looking at alternate method and some time for looking at a solution. 10 minutes per question. So in an hour, you can solve five or six questions. That is sufficient in terms of preparing. So if you're solving 10 questions, Maximum two hours will take, not more than two hours, more should be less than two hours. That should suffice. But if you're faster, then you can maybe solve more number of questions and that should help you better with regards to preparation as far as CAT is concerned. But again, I rem remind you, don't focus purely on trying to solve too many questions or focus on numbers, because in that case, your focus will be purely to solve more number of questions than maybe benefiting from actually solving the questions. Right? Hope that helps. Thank you.